AFTV, 1-0 uh, to the Arsenal. A really comfortable 1-0, wasn't it, as well? I mean, it was just a matter of time. Well, we certainly made hard work of it. Yeah. The first half was quite dull. It was too much passing, going backwards, sideways. Yeah, the first half just didn't really um, spark into anything. But the second half, whatever Arteta said to them, it worked. Yeah. And boy, we came out firing. Should have had about two or three tonight. But... Saka today. Oh, he, 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 I mean, uh, that, that, that defender running man must be having nightmares. Oh, Hoping, he's... praying that he's not in round for the second leg. Well, Saka's just been playing like that all season. Yeah. We just think, we always seem to forget how old he is. He's only like... 21 and you think how many more years we've got ahead of him and what's even better like he's one of our own mm. literally I don't I can't even remember well, funny enough you know what before the game I, w I was really interested because a lot of people been talking up Cody Gakpo yeah and I was really interested to see what he would bring to the table but in comparison to Saka I know, I know you can't judge it off of one game but He's nowhere near, and they, and, and they, they were talking about 45 up to 50 million for him. To be honest, I was surprised with Gakpo today because the seasons he's had with PSV so mm. far, he hasn't done too bad. But Tommy Asu, I think, it, who was up against yeah. him, he was absolutely brilliant against him. Mm. Gakpo couldn't get yeah, near him, but yeah. but for someone literally, like I said, who's had a very good season with PSV, he was very quiet, mm. and he was definitely the danger man because he's got good pace, he can get yeah. in behind, take on an opponent, but. If he's trying to make an impression, then that's not the sort of impression you want to give if you're coming mm. to a, a team like Arsenal. Yeah. Because I know we was linked with him as yeah. well before, and obviously United were linked with him. But yeah, he didn't. He didn't really give me any impressions at the minute, yeah. to be yeah. honest. Um, what are you looking at now? I'm thinking job done. The group's sewn up. Um, I think yeah. I think we've got the job done. PSV away next week. It'll be another tough one because they'll yeah. probably just sit back and. Uh, play for another point mm. like they did today but I think we should just about have enough quality to get the job done but I've got to say today tonight though I thought PSV were poor you would have thought for a team that's how well they've done in their league mm. and how well they've done in the Europa League you would have thought they would have came here and given us a game it's just like they just mm. sat back sat back and sat back and did, they just didn't offer nothing mm. and I was really surprised because I honestly thought PSV would have actually given us a game but they were very poor and I'm very surprised about that. And confident for Sunday? Yeah, absolutely. I think Southampton will be obviously a lot more tougher because they have got players that can hurt us. Mm. I mean, obviously, James Wars, prowse free kick specialist. Luckily, we're not up against Fraser Forster this time, mm. so hopefully it'll be um, a much more different performance. But yeah, I feel with the team that we've got at the minute, I feel we can go up there and get another massive three points. Shop for AFTV merch at shop.aftv.co.uk Subscribe to us on YouTube. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Snapchat and Twitch. We've got content for every platform, so check it out.